see here in total uh, 20 dots from uh, a regression test. We see them here, blah, blah, blah. so all of them. And the last three are colored red and they um, and suppose that we take into account all the 20 test points and then we, uh, we draw the solid line, which is the hydrostatic design basis uh, line. So, and then at 20 years, we find our strength. But suppose that just for the moment, just as uh, to, to get a bit of insight, uh, ignore all the white dots and only take into account these dots, uh, the red dots. If you uh, draw uh, an efforts line through these three dots only, you see that these are relatively flat. And if you, I mean, they're all uh, or more or less the same level. So in this case, if we would draw the efforts line, then we end up with a higher hydrostatic design basis at 20 years. You see that here at 20 years, that's roughly here, the red line is at a higher level than the black solid line. So if we would determine the hydrostatic design basis only these three test points, yeah, then we have a higher strength. And of course, for the manufacturer, it would be beneficial to report a higher strength. It uh, gives a competitive advantage. 2992 standard is specified that you take into account all uh, 20 points. But suppose that for these points uh, for a shorter duration, that you uh, yeah, make the spools of a lower quality, then the result of these test points will be a bit lower, of course, lower quality of the fabrication or the materials, then the, these points uh, drop a bit, they go, they get, they go to a lower pressure or stress. That's of course equivalent. Um, so if the, the test points for a shorter duration, if they are lower, then you get closer to the red line and then yeah, you benefit in, in the way that the hydrostatic design base is lower. So if in the test program, you would first perform the test points uh, for the longer duration and then the shorter duration tests you perform later, then if they are of lower quality, of course, lower quality is it's not positive, but if these are of lower quality, they're closer to the, the longer term strength. And yeah, the, the, the regression line becomes flatter and then you have a higher hydrostatic design basis. And yeah, there is a lot of spread in the test results. Uh, that, that's what, what we see, it's, uh, there's quite some spread. And you see how variations in the test results can affect uh, the outcome and the hydrostatic design basis. And it is one drawback of the regression testing. Of course, it, it would help if you do more and more testing, maybe then you would come close to the efforts. But yeah, this test program is already two years, so normally it's limited to uh, uh, these 20 test points. Mm -hmm.